Hello and welcome. I'm KMC and this is how to build the Paw Patrol lookout. Now guys, this has been a long, long night for me. It's now very early hours, five o'clock in the morning. I get very lost on these uh, these builds. Really can't help it. It happens. Plus the fact I'm building essentially two of them. <laughs> um, hope you guys are enjoying it. Hope uh, keeps your little ones happy, really, because uh, I'm hoping it does for my son. I that's why I stayed up most at night. To be honest, I done the same with the Mickey Mouse house. You end up just chucking so much unbelievable time in trying to get it right, and we will get it. I would say spot on, but um, obviously I want to. Uh, I want it to be usable, which. Uh, if it was spot on, it would be an elevator inside. Um, if you have any ideas on what we can do with the inside, chuck them at me. Um, be very happy for the uh, feedback. Um, we are going to get a working slide. I'm playing with the idea of uh, using a minecart and track. Just because it is a long slide. Um, the difference with the Mickey Mouse one is I cut it a bit shorter. Um, and just made it out of ice uh, this one I was going to suggest putting water down the slide but then I had to think then there's going to be water pouring out at the bottom uh, like a waterfall not necessarily a bad thing but it's not going to be accurate nor is a minecart mind but it will be invisible to the point that you can just chuck it you know you fall out the cart who cares? You've gone down the slide. Mm, hopefully, you know it is. I don't know. Still, still playing with the idea. If you guys have any uh, ideas, suggestions, chuck them at me. Chuck them in the uh, comments. I won't ignore them. Um, essentially, the only well, I'd reply to within the video anyway. If we didn't use the idea, it's purely because it, it didn't work for me. Uh, you probably have heard me say that a couple of times for the night purely because I, I'm really one of them people it's like OCD once I get started on something I go back, I tear down, I go back Essentially, that, that's why I built two buildings really um, because I didn't want you to end up watching a video because let's face it, once you build this you're not going to tear it down and start again and it's going to be hard overlooking it so I thought build it twice go uh, through the layers when I'm happy with that layer then build it onto this one um, to be honest the other building is quite different to this one um, because in the end it become one of them buildings that actually showed me what I didn't want to do which is a good thing but uh, yeah it's, it's been mad it's been a long long night and I really hope you get some enjoyment out of it. <laughs> it's uh, it's always enjoyable to do. Uh, it keeps the brain busy. Um, I mean, the crushing moment is going to be knocking down the other one because <laughs> I've got to now make room for the the garage underneath uh, the sort of like hideout. Um, it's got to be done, but uh, it's going to be a long long tear down process but when I say long long it's like 10 minutes and 10 minutes is a long time when it's just knocking stuff down probably be longer than that to be honest I'm not too sure so anyway guys I hope the build is um, working for yourselves I've tried to make it as accurate as possible um, like I say certain things I've tried to keep the build in not massive and the reason being is because I do want it usable um, even if it's with rooms um, I want it to be as close as possible but at the same time I don't want it to a case of where it's going to be hard to use no because uh, my son is only young um, so the more basic it is the better it is for him um, essentially I want it to be like a uh, like with a Mickey Mouse house it essentially created like a playground and I, s 
sort of want to do that. Have something that's, uh, you know, it's fun to run around. Essentially, the imagination does more for you. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop rambling because I've done it for the last video. And the only reason I'm doing it is because I've been up all night. And I haven't seen anyone, so I'm like, <laughs> I think I'm taking out on you. You're probably feeling the same way as my uh, girlfriend does when I talk to her. Just like, will you please stop? Why won't you stop talking? <laughs> but it, I just can't help it. It's been a lonely night. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoy it. Um, please like and subscribe if uh, you do. Um, if not, tell me how I can make it more usable for yourselves. Apart from that, guys, hope you enjoy. Happy building. Look guys, you would have just seen the other building, um, I hope that explains to you why I haven't included the yellow stripe, because the red is much thicker than the yellow. Um, essentially, in the actual build itself, um, the only thing this material would be thin enough is carpet, but obviously when you play a carpet, it takes up a full block space, so no can do on that one. So. Basically, I've just taken the yellow out. Um, looking through pictures online continuously through tonight, and if you look at the toys, they don't include the uh, yellow parts. So, until like, obviously, I'm going to include the yellow on top of the uh, where they stand on top. Um, but for the feet, it just wasn't. I, I found it just made it look more. Uh, out of it less accurate so I thought take it out it's not worth having it <laughs> do you know it's mad that it's not got block out only to put it back oh, you, you can tell it's been a long night anyway guys I, I thought I'd just uh, take the opportunity to sort of say that's why I didn't want to include the yellow if you have any improvements for the um, the shield love to hear it I've done it that way um, purely because, like I say, I'm trying to keep the building within context. Uh, I don't really want it to get out of control and end up a skyscraper. Cause it's going to be a big building anyway. It still needs to go on top for the, uh, the stand. And obviously, then you've got the glass room. The slide has still got to go on. And as well as the slide still need to put the roof on as well 
and that's essentially going to be at least um, I'm, go I'm going to give it a guess but it's going to be at least 15, 15 layers I would have thought maybe not 15 layers but I don't know I don't know it could be about 15 layers I really don't want to put you off of building it you know <laughs> but yeah probably it is going to be 15 layers by the time we get the top on but I, I'm trying to keep it so you know if you've built it for maybe your kids or even for you younger viewers actually building it yourself I want you to look at it and think that's the patrol you know that's the lookout um, once we have done this uh, we go over interior get the kennels built we then include the, the garage I did explain in the last video I can only go three layers deep so essentially I'm gonna have to go forward and then build up probably two layers and then have to come back on myself so there will be sort of like a hill mound in my version um, if you're not playing on a flat land you probably won't have that problem I've purely got that problem because playing in uh, creator mode I've kept it on the flat land thinking it was easier some buildings most definitely well most buildings crack in and then you get buildings like this one and a couple of others that I've tried to put like drives and garages in and you end up that you've actually not got enough space underneath you have to then build up off the ground which is such a worse job <laughs> it really is a bad job to do trying to pull up ground rather than uh, dig down so anyway guys I'm, I'm going to stop going on um, hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching guys uh, please like and subscribe and I will catch you probably not any time too soon with the next pipe when I say that it will be out there tonight but I think I will probably get some sleep um, at some point if I haven't got no sleep uh, by a certain time I'll probably crack on with the next layer to be honest uh, you know the next next part of the build um, like I say any feedback any uh, advice or suggestions chuck them out there that's what it's all about uh, essentially the build is for all of us so yeah and, and also if you've got any suggestions on what we can do inside because I do want to make it usable um, and to make it usable essentially we're going to need rooms stairs uh, the slide is going to go around it I'm going to try and keep it as much as possible to the real thing um, but at the same time keeping it usable and it is going to be a big building uh, obviously we know what's going to go on top um, guys thanks for watching <laughs>